the first recipient of a Neuralink brain chip implant, as disclosed by the company's founder, Elon Musk, is currently in the process of recovery. Musk, in a recent post on the social media platform X, mentioned that the initial findings indicate promising detection of neuron spikes. These spikes represent neural activity responsible for transmitting information within the brain and to other parts of the body. While several other companies are working on innovative products in the field of brain chip implants, Neuralink stands out by joining a limited number of companies that have successfully implanted such devices in humans. However, it is essential to approach this news with caution, recognizing that the true success of these endeavors can only be assessed in the long term. Elon Musk's habit of generating publicity for his company adds an additional reason to be careful with the implication of this success. Last year, the U.S. Food and Drug Administration granted Neuralink clearance to initiate its first human trial for testing the implant, a crucial step in the startup's pursuit of assisting patients in overcoming paralysis and various neurological conditions. We have a video on this, and we will add a link to it in the description below. The trial involves the use of a robot to surgically implant a brain-computer interface in a brain region controlling the intention to move. Neuralink's primary objective is to empower individuals to control a computer cursor or keyboard solely through their thoughts. The ultra-fine threads of the implants facilitate the transmission of signals within participants' brains. Elon Musk disclosed that Neuralink's initial product will be named Telepathy. This first trial, conducted focuses on evaluating the safety of the implant and the surgical robot used in the wireless brain-computer interface. In a separate post, Musk explained that telepathy aims to enable users to control phones, computers, and nearly any device through mere thoughts. The initial users targeted are those who have lost the use of their limbs. It is noteworthy that Musk's involvement has elevated Neuralink's profile, yet some competitors boast a track record spanning two decades. For instance, BlackRock Neurotech, based in Utah, implanted its first brain-computer interface in 24. Precision Neuroscience, founded by a co-founder of Neuralink, also endeavors to assist individuals with paralysis. While Mr. Musk claims significant progress, independent verification of these claims is lacking, and Neuralink has not provided detailed information about the procedure described. In the broader context, other companies, such as a Swiss firm, have achieved breakthroughs in enabling paralyzed individuals to walk by implanting electronic devices on the brain and spine, allowing wireless communication with the legs and feet. If you find value in this video, kindly subscribe to our channel so that you can be notified anytime we release a new video with a life-saving medical innovation. Note that knowledge is advancing by the day, and we will like to always post an update on new advances on how to stay healthy. You can contact us via the link in the description below for any medical inquiry. You are watching Zoom Hospital Channel and listening to work of Dr. Cariotti.